Good evening, everyone, and welcome to the Fashion Show 2017. <laughs> My name is Ian Steenhook. I'm a sophomore here at Iowa State. I'm studying journalism and mass communications with a double minor in performing arts in Durban, and I'm excited to be emceeing my first ever fashion show with you all. Please welcome to the stage our managerial producers for the show, Hannah Nation and Alexandra Johnson. Good evening. My name is Hannah Nation. And my name is Alexandra Johnson, and we are the managerial producers for the Fashion Show 2017. Planning a show of this scale of, takes a lot of teamwork, and we couldn't do it without the help of our amazing organization of over 170 students. The hard work of our directors, committee members, designers, and models made this night possible. Our planning began about a year ago, and since then, everyone has worked hard to make all aspects of the show possible. Our show would also not be possible without the help of our amazing faculty within the Imperil Merchandising and Design Program. We would like to take a few moments to recognize their contributions. Would everyone please join in giving them a round of applause? One of the best parts of our program at Iowa State is our relationship with the professional industry. We would like to welcome our visiting apparel, merchandising, and design industry circle members. Please join us in giving them a round of applause as well. We would like to welcome back and recognize our visiting apparel, merchandising, and design alumni. Please stand up. Lastly, we would like to acknowledge our online viewers. This is the first year we are live streaming the show. It is so exciting that we can share tonight's celebration with alumni and friends all across the country, from New York to LA. Thank you for joining us tonight. We couldn't be more thrilled to welcome the new Dean of the College of Human Sciences, Dean Laura Jolly. This is her first year at Iowa State, and we are so honored that she is giving our opening remarks. Please welcome to the stage, Dean Laura Jolly. Well, good evening, style mavens, fashionistas, and friends. You are in for a treat. I've had a little bit of a behind the scenes tour, and it's going to be great. This is the 2017 fashion show at Iowa State University. And as you know, this is a flagship event for the state, for our department, for our college and the university. So we're glad to have you here. This is the 35th show. So this grand event has been ongoing for 35 years. And one of its hallmarks is that it is completely student run. You heard our producers say that we have over 170 students from all over the university that are participating, from the garments that you'll see on the runway, to the stage art, to all of those things that happen behind the, the scenes. Our students have produced this, have envisioned it, and you're going to really enjoy it. It's going to be a spectacular show. So thank you for being here. Thank you to all of those that have supported our students, have provided time, talent, dollars to help them envision and produce this event. Um, it takes all of us, and so I'm so excited to be here for the first show for me at Iowa State University. So the, the theme is Altered States. So I know that you're looking forward to all of the creative things that our students have done. So with that, sit back and enjoy the show. Thank you. Enthusiasm is a driving force for the Fashion Show 2017. We encourage you to share your enthusiasm throughout the evening. Please note that flash photography is prohibited. On behalf of everyone, we, we invite you to prepare yourselves for altered aspects. Thank you. 
welcome to our Altered Aspects. to our altered aspects. to our altered aspects.
Who enjoyed the first half of the show? Can we give another round of applause for the talented student designers and models?
The fashion show is proud to share connections to many industry professionals through connections to alumni and networking to design houses. Yearly, the fashion show invites a fashion designer of significance in the industry to present a collection of garments on the runway. In doing this, students are able to aspire for professional success just as the guest designer has achieved through his or her own collection presented on the runway. We'd like to invite the fashion show 2017's outreach producers, Emily Meyer and Maggie Anderson to the stage to introduce tonight's guest designer. Hello everyone, my name is Maggie Anderson. And my name is Emily Meyer, and we are the outreach producers for the fashion show 2017. Maggie and I have had the... <laughs> Maggie and I have had the pleasure of inviting and hosting Abdul Abbasi and Greg Rossborough of Abbasi Rossborough as this year's guest designer. Last year, Greg was a guest judge and spoke about Abbasi Rossborough at our Meet the Judges event. It is then when Greg expressed his interest about becoming a guest designer for the fashion show. We couldn't have been more excited to welcome him back alongside his co-founder, Abdul, to Iowa State. Please welcome Greg and Abdul as they speak about their autumn winter 2017 collection. Thank you very much. And I just want to say, can we have a round of applause for all the designers so far? Great, so my name is Abdul Abbasi, and this is uh, uh, Greg Rosborough, and we're Abbasi Rosborough. And we are super excited, proud, and privileged to be here. We have a great show for you guys. Um, we're work working with some of the best young people we've ever seen in our lives. And this, uh, Basically, the inspiration for us was bringing people together. So we live in America, and it's every shade, you know, every size, every sort of nationality here. And what we're going to show you today is what we believe is the future, these young people. Yeah, and so just to give you a quick uh, background on why we designed this collection. So each season, uh, this is our eighth collection we've done together. And each season, we try to um, think about what are we emotionally reacting to? Something that could be a trip, it could be people. But in this case, what we were emotionally reacting to, um, well, we were designing the collection in September and October, so last fall. And you guys all know, every single day we woke up um, in September and October, there was news about the election on TV and in the news. And, uh, you know, here we were uh, watching this election go down and thinking, how is this the election for the best amongst all of our people to represent us? It's so negative, it's so fractured, and it's so us versus them. And we're a country of warm people, welcoming, everyone has a story and a background and a nationality. And so we wanted to do a collection that we were feeling, which was unity and unification of the United States. So that's what we're gonna show for you. The collection is also involving a protest a little bit. Um, You'd see images of, of protests where these protesters would be in t-shirts and jeans against riot police with tactical gear and glass masks and bulletproof vests. So we decided to come up with something that's about unity but also protecting the protester. So we hope you enjoy and uh, here we go. And please hold applause to the end. Yeah, all applause till the end. Please. Just enjoy. Thank you right, so thanks. much.
Did you enjoy the garments from Abbasi Rasboro? The fashion show would like to thank Greg Rossboro and Abdul Abbasi for taking part in tonight's runway show. The footwear featured in tonight's guest designer collection was courtesy of Bridge. We would also like to give a round of applause to the Des Moines Isisarets for their involvement in Abbasi Rossboro's portion of the show. We are pleased to introduce the second half of the Fashion Show 2017, Altered Aspects.
Let's give a round of applause to the second half of the show this evening. We'd like to recognize our Friends of the Fashion Show sponsors who were monumental in making tonight a success. Please refer to your program to see a complete list of all of our sponsors. We would also like to thank the team at Studio 7 for providing their services in styling the hair and makeup of all models for tonight's event. They're continuous supporters of the fashion show and make the models look great year after year. Let's give Studio 7 a hand. Before we get to the awards, let's take a minute to recognize all of the students who put their hard work into making the fashion show a success. All designs featured this evening were designed and created by Iowa State University students. Please join us in congratulating these talented young designers as they walk the runway.
The fashion show would not have been possible without the hard work of our wonderful committee members. They have been selected and led throughout the course of the semester in the preparation of planning and organizing various events leading up to tonight's show. Each committee member is a huge asset in making the fashion show 2017 a success. Please help us in recognizing their outstanding work as they walk the runway. We are very proud of the overall collaboration and dedication of our director teams over the past year to the numerous responsibilities and tasks they have been devoted to. Each team puts in many hours planning and leading a committee of students. Please join us in celebrating the accomplishments of each director team. <laughs> Alumni and Community Relations, Sam Iverson, Abigail Horry, and Anna Hubbard. Connor Mormon and Ellen Titman. Behind the scenes, Sydney Klein, Jaden Mueller, Josie Brown Miller, and Mary Jane Halder. Design. Sarah Wagand, Ashlyn Boerhave, and Jessica Helberg. Fashion Week, Jenna Colin, Molly Hawks, Haley Volbrecht, and Claire Schubert. Fundraising, Nicole Bell and Leah Beeman. Gallery and display, Shannon Thompson and Alana Hill. Modeling, Katie Hamilton, Grace Rawson, and Sasha Spock. Photography, Morena Walschlager and Caroline Bailey. Pop 
pop-up shop. Emily Olson, Nicole Vandenbosch, and Aaron Connor. and marketing, Sarah Knobel, Ethan Lindley, and Selena Hiltz. Design, Courtney Bargman, Ashton Nepper, and Wen Ji Zhang. Design, Katherine Kaleberg and Emily Clark. and Human Resources, Seth Fridley and Olivia Cooch. As part of the fearless leadership team for the fashion show, the outreach producers are essential to the organization and success of this event. Please welcome to the stage two of the inaugural recipients of the Anna McCracken Producer Scholarship, outreach producers Emily Meyer and Maggie Anderson. Having begun preparations back in May, our managerial producers share an unyielding passion for the fashion show. They are involved in all aspects and preparation. Please welcome to the stage the other inaugural recipients of the Anna McCracken Producer Scholarship, managerial producers Hannah Nation and Alexandra Johnson. The producers, directors, and committee members have enjoyed working over the past year with faculty advisor Sarah Bennett, who has dedicated much of her time and energy to ensure the fashion show 2017 was a success. Her motivating spirit and helpful hand have given all of the members of the fashion show an opportunity to grow in the past year. We would also like to take the opportunity to recognize a valued addition to this year's team. As a graduate of Iowa State and the Berkeley School of Music, Nicholas Hatfield was initially hired as the fashion show's DJ. 
Throughout the semester, he has expanded the role by composing original music for the entire production, adding a new dimension to the interpretation of this year's theme. Please help us in thanking Nick for his hard work and dedication. We would also like to thank our online viewers for tuning in to tonight's production. After the show, please take a five minutes and fill, a fill out a demographic survey uh, you will find below the media player. To begin the scholarship portion of tonight's show, we will start with a scholarship that was announced yesterday. Every year, the day before the fashion show is called Behind the Scenes Day, when high school students interested in the apparel, merchandising, and design program can come and experience what it's like to be an AMD student. This year, we were pleased to offer the second annual Behind the Scenes Trend Center Freshman Scholarship to Sophia Liu. We are also pleased to announce that Todd Snyder will be awarding a paid internship and scholarship to an Iowa State student for this upcoming summer. Todd Snyder is an Iowa State alumni who founded his namesake menswear label in 2011. Since that time, he has been nominated three times for a CFDA Swarovski menswear award and was just selected as one of GQ magazine's best new designers in America. Just this spring, he was nominated for the CFDA Menswear Award with a winner to be announced in June. Todd Snyder offers the internship and scholarships in memoriam of Ruth Glock, whose positive attitude and passion for teaching helped Todd and many other students in the fashion industry. The winner of this year's scholarship is Leah Docterman. <laughs> We will now move into the scholarships for the work you have seen on the runway and in the mounted exhibits this evening. On Saturday, March 25th, a team of four industry professionals visited Iowa State's campus to serve as a fashion show panel of judges. This year's judges were Sarah Clapper, market planner for North America Boys Gap Brand, James K. Ryan, retired apparel brand manager, Tina Wagner, freelance color specialist out of Los Angeles, and Miranda Nichols Prosecco, costume designer out of Los Angeles. They've judged each entry on creativity, technical skills, and execution. Here are the winners of the Fashion Show 2017. Third place in fashion illustration was a tie between Meraki by Devin Brudson and Hope Springs Eternal by Camber Cosmaker. Second place in fashion illustration is awarded to Cosmic Love by Dylan Heyer. And first place in fashion illustration is awarded to Ubuntu by Emily Clark. <laughs> Second place in sustainability Floor Nocturna by Josefina Avalos. And first place in sustainability is Volcanic by Jamie Towley. Second place in activewear, swimwear, and intimates is Beleza Viaja by Ashlyn Barhave. And first place in activewear, swimwear, and intimates is awarded to Ceaseless by Caroline Bailey. Third place in children's wear. Tiny Fashionista by Jamie Towley and Gretchen Larson. Second place in children's wear, Toddler Girls Two-Piece Animal Multi-Legging Set by Jordan Hollinger and Emily Clark. And first place in children's wear is awarded to Gwendolyn by Emily Clark.
first place in portfolio is Mid-Century Lookbook by Anna Licklitter. Second place in menswear is awarded to Rainer by Leah Docterman. And first place in menswear is awarded to Mid-Century by, by Anna Licklitter. Third place in Ready to Wear Fall and Winter is awarded to Panther in the Moonlight by Jess Eberl. Second place in Ready to Wear Fall and Winter is Functional Knit Dress by Kai Yu Yang. And first place in Ready to Wear Fall and Winter is awarded to Not Your Ordinary Briefcase by Lydia Loya. Third place in Ready to Wear Spring and Summer is Pineapple Print Romper by, Kat by Catherine Kelberg. <laughs> Second place in Ready to Wear Spring and Summer is Freight and Feminine by Meredith Bago. <laughs> by Excuse me, that was Meredith Miller. First place in Ready to Wear Spring and Summer is awarded to Blossomed by Caitlin Bago. <laughs> Second place in special occasion cocktail is Blooming Gold by Marcilia Uvita. <laughs> and first place in special occasion cocktail is awarded to Solidified Motion by Emily Clark. <laughs> Second place in Special Occasion Evening Wear is awarded to Golden Girl by Liza Cutsforth. <laughs> and first place in Special Occasion Evening Wear goes to Pretty in Gold by Basilia Coster. Third place in wearable art is awarded to Miro by Emily Clark. Second place in wearable art is Reflection by Jess Iberl. And first place in wearable art is awarded to Emotions from the Heart by Leah Docterman, Alex Peters, and Joris Montiel. Some of the garments in the show tonight are digitally printed, a service offered by the Department of Apparel, Merchandising, and Design. Our program is very lucky to have this technology available to students as part of the uh, Digital Apparel Textile Studies studio in LeBaron Hall. Third place in digital printing, menswear vest from Track Suits by Leah Docterman. <laughs> Second place in digital printing, is Glitch, Accidental Art, by Cassidy Glynn. And first place in digital printing, Emotions from the Heart, by Leah Docterman, Alex Peters, and Joris Montillo. Third place in collections was another tie between Glitch, by Ac Glitch Accidental Art by Cassidy Glynn and Bizarre Future by Alex Peters. <laughs> Second place in collections, Adagio by Kara Sander. <laughs> and first place in collections is awarded to Becoming by Sarah Matter. <laughs> 
for the second year, the fashion show is proud to present the Laura and Russ Talbot ISU Fashion Show Merchandising Scholarship. This year, our HR director, Olivia Cooch, worked directly with the team at Abercrombie and Fitch Corporate Headquarters to develop a case study project for the scholarship application. The winner of the second annual Laura Russ Talbot ISU Fashion Show Merchandising Scholarship is Maggie Anderson. Finally, the award we've all been waiting for. The winner of the Laura Russ Talbot ISU Fashion Show Best in Show Scholarship is Becoming by Sarah Matter. We congratulate the award winners on their outstanding work. Thank you to, many, to our many friends of the fashion show who made these awards possible. The winning entries will be on display at the Mary Alice Gallery in Morrow Hall beginning on April 26th. You are also invited to attend the gallery exhibit opening on Wednesday, April 26th from 5 to 6 p.m. DVDs of the show will be available through the awesome department. Watch our Facebook page for information on ordering. Thank you for joining us for the Fashion Show 17. We hope you join us again next year on April 14th, 2018. Have a great night.